Hello everybody and welcome back to some mega modded Gungeon here with Never Named. Hello. Hi. Hi, I'm here. I'm here. You may not have seen me. Oh no, you probably have because the massive backlog, but I've been very sad and alone because Turtles, he's been neglecting me. He's I been, have. I've, he I've, I've been, he's been opting. He's been working. He's been working all the time. I've been opting to not, make money given, to live rather than record he, with Never Named. He, it's he, been a tragedy. He skipped our son's softball game. I did. He's such but, a neglectful. But yeah, I decided to let Never Named out the basement this weekend for a recording session. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Thank you. <laughs> the shackles are unrestrained now, so we're gonna we're gonna do a a bit. I, obviously, this isn't really relevant to any of you watching this episode right now because these episodes are gonna be so far apart. But we're gonna record a Gungeon. We're gonna record some Portal, which is coming soon-ish once we finish the Half-Life games, and maybe even one of the Half-Life episodes if we've got time. So we're, we're, all, we're doing a big old sesh, because we haven't got to record recently, and my work has been hell yeah. hella busy. And yeah. Anyway, so we're going to jump in. I am playing Not A Bot's new character from Enter The Beyond. I believe that the character is fixed and working as intended. If it's not, I will refrain from well, showing off the character too much more, and we'll just switch characters. But the wand that we kind of half showed off a few weeks back should be fixed you now. You believe. I believe. Basically, what I'm you saying is... believe. It should be fixed, but I'm playing the game. So, who the fuck knows? Because I always break You're everything. Cursed. Exactly. It, it, it could be working perfectly fine for every other human on Earth. But on my PC... That doesn't really mean anything. It will it will still yeah. break. So we're going to jump on in and just see what happens. No, yeah, you're basically broken. I oh, like yeah. that animation. Yeah, I do too. I really like the um the the dodge rolling animation. I think it's it's got quite a lot of style to it. Even though like it's it's fairly basic sprite wise, it it's got a lot of uh, personality to it. Yeah, and it glows. That that yeah. takes actual effort. Yeah, I like it a lot. So, uh what's the plan? Are we dying or are we living? Why do the bullets look like that? Why do the bullets look like a lot? That. Wait, what? Did they look wrong? I don't know, they look square. They do look square, that is true. Maybe they're meant to be square, but... Okay, so the way that this works is we start with this wand, and we can press a button, which I don't remember which button it is, to switch the spell mode. Like, I literally cannot remember what button it is. I forget what button it is. Well, Never you named. better figure it out then. Research it, I don't quick. Know. Push buttons, push buttons. What are you I'm, I'm literally pushing everything. Dude. There's a reason that I blanked. Maybe Try it's... reloading without firing first? Nope. I don't know. Ah, Did you... I, picked, I picked up a spell, didn't I? You're like, oh yeah, you know, I'm going to showcase this character. By the way, how does this character work? <laughs> Let's go to the mod page and check. <laughs> oh, for the love of the lord. It's a false start, baby, but we're, we're keeping the recording Mulligan. going. Mulligan. Mulligan? Yes. Who's Mulligan? It doesn't say. <laughs> Mulligan. No, I can't oh, make wand. a joke out of that. A customizable gun um, that will... That you can swap in and out of change modes while the gun from enemies will rarely spawn spells. It doesn't tell me. Okay, so... What did you just do? Uh, I was uh, scratching an itch and my hand slipped and I punched myself in the nose. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> I'm a professional. How, so, like, how do you forget this? I don't know. I Like, I swear, last time I played the character, it was really obvious how to do it. But it's obviously because I'm on controller and it's not designed for controller. But, like, it definitely does work because I did it before. But now I can't remember what it is. It's like you hold one of the buttons, but I, I can't remember which one it is. Then just hold them all systematically. What, oh, there you go. There you go. There you go. I, I got it. I got it. Got it. So, okay. bouncy. Let's go with bouncy. Yeah, it I'm works. Not sure what, I'm not sure what the three out of three means. I think you can, uh, like, change loadouts. So... Basically, from what I from what I remember, okay, let me just kill this room and I'll, I'll go back and sort of show it off. Because um, I kind of remember how it works for the most part. It's a really, really interesting system. Oh, fuck, that I actually quite like. I might die on this run on the first floor. That would be quite impressive. Uh, so essentially, the way that it works is 
Here you have your spells, which is basically like your loadouts. You can change between whichever one you want, so like hot swap. And then this is how many spells you have. So you have none, which is like your default basic. Spark Bolt, which is a new type of spell, and then Bouncy. And basically, as you kill enemies, you get different um, upgrades and different spells. And then you can switch your spell types, and then you can hot swap between them using these. Yeah, but why, why does why does it say, like, Spark Bolt 1 out of 3, Bouncy 3 out of 3? Because there are three spells, and Spark Bolt is number 1, Non is number 2, and well, Bouncy no, is no, number no, 3. No, look, at, look, scroll through them, scroll through them. Again, well, go back and look through them. Spark three. Bolt is 1. One. None is two. two. Bouncy is three. There's three spells. I, How are you not getting this? I. I shut what? up! <laughs> How does that not make sense to you? I, I thought it was. You, okay, you must have been swapping back and forth, and I wasn't paying too close attention. Because I, I saw it going 3 1, 3 1, and I was like, where's two? <laughs> Uh, never name doesn't understand how incremental numbers work. Shut up, you don't fucking understand most things. <laughs> <laughs> oh my lord, that was funny. Right, so that now we've we've picked up faster bullets. Okay, so one thing I am noticing is it didn't update to three out of four until I swapped, but now we've got faster bullets, so we can like do that and then Whoa! Those boys are fast. Holy hell. Oh also we got the penis cannon, nice. And cue bullets. Uh, nice, I love shooting my goo. <laughs> oh lord. To be fair, if this bullet was coming out of this gun, things would look quite oh. awry. Oh lord. <laughs> oh lord, he coming. <laughs> quite oh, literally. God. <laughs> Shut up, stop talking. I think spell drops might be a bit too common. Yeah, I said it said it said rarely. This this currently is not rare. We've had we've had like four so far. Also, I'm not getting any UI pop up for what the spell is for some reason, which what's, I did on the first what's the, one. What's the point in getting duplicate spells? Yeah, also, I, why? yeah, I've got two faster bullets. I'm guessing that's unintended. Also, why does why does okay? Why can you choose between spell the top and the top row? Why can you choose spell one two three whatever, I, I and then at the bottom I also already, choose spell one two three whatever? I already told you this. One minute, let me finish this room and explain it again for your feeble brain. You, right, you don't want to start this fight. <laughs> so, this here is what spell you have currently equipped. But because there's yeah. so many spells in the game, you don't want to have to swap between all of them. So you can you, you can basically make loadouts. So I can have spell one as Spark Bolt. Then I can have spell two as Bouncy. Okay, spell so you're bookmarking spells. Exactly. Yeah. You're bookmarking spells. You could have just said that. Well, I I, I don't think bookmarking is the best way to say it. But whatever, whatever. Well, well, a loadout isn't the best way to say I it either. I, shut up. <laughs> yes, my my loadout of one thing. Hey guys, pick one thing. That's well, no, your loadout. No, Co like all of them collectively become your loadout. But you only have one equipped at a time. Shut up, all right? How are they collectively your loadout if you only have one equipped at a time? I don't know. And oh, that's shit, shit, why... shit, shit, shit. Oh, I accidentally started swapping my spell. Okay, this faster bolts one is 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 pretty trash. Um I think bouncy was probably the best one. Why why has it only got what didn't it have two in the magazine before? Why does it only have one now? It had like th I don't know what happened there. It had uh, like two or three in the magazine. Now it's only please has one. Fix. Please fix. No, it's probably it some sort of there's probably some sort of reason behind it. I just don't understand. Maybe yeah, maybe the reason is the code's broken. <laughs> maybe when you swap your bookmarks, it changes the magazine. I don't know. Let's let's find out. This is a, a very experimental and explorationary. Um, why is it not working now? Oh, I've not. Because you're not on. holding the fucking hmm. wand. Whoopsie. Jesus. You're a fucking okay, rocket no. surgeon, are you? Maybe it gets more magazine size on kill or room clear or something? It, I don't no, know. It's gotten progressively less on kill and room clear. So I don't know why you're going with that hypothesis. I'm just guessing. Just guessing. Well, I think I'm probably going to buy the, uh, the fun cannon. Funk cannon. Now I think it's the fun cannon because it makes it sound even more like a penis. 
It's the fun Ganon. The fun Ganon. The fun so, Ganon. We, an we got another spark bolt. Okay, yeah, definitely. Th that's either got to be a bug or a very bizarre decision to have it. Um, what the hell? Spark bolt. Oh, what the okay. Go into a different room. Because, like, you're in the most cramped corridor. I think Spark Bolt just... Wait, is it in... Why is it bouncy as well? I don't know. Maybe it's like an... Let, let, let me try Spark Bolt 1 and see if there's any difference. Nope. Okay, I, I don't know. I'm confused. Turtle, I think your major issue is that you're assuming it's intentional. Yeah, that's true. I think Basically, it's just a glitch. I have to assume at all times whenever I'm playing Gungeon, or any game for that matter, that it is indeed broken and not working as intended. Because things don't work as intended on my game. Also, where the hell is my um Where the hell is my new modifier uh, bullet modifier chest from Sophia's mod? It's supposed there's supposed to be one on every flare first floor. I feel cheated. Well, cheated, I got this A class gun, man. It sucks to be I'm cheated. Not, to be right? fair, I'm actually not a big fan of this gun at all. So. Yeah, because you suck. You're just not a fan of tentacles, and that's sad. <laughs> Woo! I do like the fact that you can do that, though. It's, it, it looks pretty nice. Woo! It just burns the ammo, though. Yeah, because it's a broom clearer, not a boss killer. Oh shit! I activated the minion. And you deactivated him immediately with the power of tentacle. Yeah. Someone should make a resprite mod that makes it into an actual minion. To be fair, Bulletkins, thinking about it, are quite close to minions. Stop this train of thought immediately. <laughs> They're like the right colour. They've got like the stubby Stop little arms. Stop this and train legs. of thought immediately. <laughs> I really think someone should make a mod that just resprites all bulletkins into minions. <laughs> if someone does that, I will genuinely put it on my series and never remove it. There's a parking space in hell for people like you. <laughs> that is a that is something that I can't believe I've never thought of, and I can't believe no one has ever done before. Like that is. It's Truly the forbidden impressive. knowledge. It's the forbidden knowledge. The forbidden fruit. I think we've we've. Uh, I say we. I think I've released evil upon an end to the gungeon with this thought. Everyone has thought it, but no one was brave enough to say it. Yeah, bravery. Well, that's that's <laughs> what we're calling it. Yeah. <sighs> we can call it bravery. We can call it bravery. Oh, That's exactly what it is. Oh, right, I'm gonna. Oh, do I only get spells? Do I, do I only get spells if I kill enemies with the wand, or can I get spells at any point? Because I kind of want to just run around with this, kill a bunch of rooms, and then like stack up a bunch of spells, and then come back to the wand a little later when I have more spells. But where's killing word? When do we get that spell? What's killing word? When do I get the wish spell? What? When do I get the wish spell? From wish.com. Uh, that answers your question. You don't need to kill them with the wand. It does. Why did he give you a key? I think he was a champion. I think I killed him while he was spawning in, but he was a champion. I think that's why. I'm hoping we get some yeah, of the, uh, the bunny rooms soon. This gun sucks dick. I really like it though. This is one of those guns that it's not very really good, but I do really enjoy it. It's better off in rooms with pets, and even then it's try trash. Trash. Oh, you want to do the second floor again? Not really. Why not? Because I'd have to give up my active for it. I quite like my yes, active. It's not a good active. It's pretty good. It's like a... It's like the bomb, but better. It does less damage with less radius, but you can use it faster. That's exactly. just what it is. Exactly. Oh my god. Kill things quicker, please. Oh, 
Oh, it's Unfortunately, it's so pencil. sad and limp when it has no ammo. What does? The tentacle. Oh. <laughs> I've never actually noticed that days. before. You all have those days where you're limp. Yes. When I have no ammo. <laughs> oh god, I'm not liking this analogy. This isn't an innuendo. I have no bullets in me and it makes me sad. <laughs> Shoot me, please. <laughs> yes, please, end me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I had a really funny moment in uh, in the modding uh, Discord of uh, Binding of Isaac the other day. Some dude came in and was like, Andromeda is such an utter shit character. And of course I was like, well, no. And also like, why? You gave no argument whatsoever. And they were like, L, no. L plus ratio? No, they're just shit. They're just shit. And obviously, like, it seemed like the person was very obviously coming to the modding channel specifically to aggravate the modders. Like, like, there's no other reason you'd come in and say a character was shit with no argument. Um, but they didn't give any reasoning or anything. And um, then I, I, say, I said something along the lines of anyone that thinks um, Andromeda is shit is a doofus. Uh, and, th and they responded with like probably one of the the weirdest. I think reduced cooldown is pretty good. Yeah, it's really good. Um, still a bit weak though. But yeah, I I, I think uh, he responded. Bouncing. He responded with um, one of the weirdest comebacks I've ever seen. He's he's essentially said, said something along the lines of, "You must be stupid because your dad made you, and your dad's stupid." And it, it's just a very poorly formed insult. Uh, and I just, I just replied with, "Oh God, I'm so bent. Uh, just gonna go kill myself real quick." And they just replied, "Do it," and then the mods banned them. Wow, <laughs> you're stupid because you you don't make it. It's like, it's stupid. like I get that my joke was probably in poor taste, saying just gonna kill myself real nah. quick. But I think adding the "Oh damn, I'm bent" and real quick made it very obviously a joke, and they replied with something that very obviously was not a joke. It's just funny to me that some uh, people are, yeah. are, are are on that level of like he thought he he thought he did so well. Yeah. <laughs> I, I just I just replied with this is hilarious. Also, oh, fuck God. yes, we got one of these. I this is like one of my favorite additions to the game. Like I really love risk reward, and this is like the perfect thing for risk reward. The only thing this could do better is just have more options. But even then, I haven't seen all the options yet. Ooh, explosive birth is. Oh, real that's my fun. favorite. I, don't I know love what con explosive birth. I don't know what contractual obligation does, but I know what explosive birth does, and I like explosive birth quite a lot. But yeah, I'm gonna say the the ability to be able to trade away master rounds is just a, a, a genuinely, absolutely fantastic, fantastic idea. I love explosive birth. It's like explosive diarrhea, but instead of the chicken nuggets you had last night, it's children. Oh god. <laughs> Right, do we want to buy anything on this wall? Also, the music went quiet and it scared me. Um, I think it's an issue with the... Uh... No, I don't want to buy anything on this wall. Do you want to open this chest, though? Hey, Synergy. Ooh, what does this do? Uh, we'll try the, uh, try the gun. Oh, nice. Okay, okay. I like that, I like that. The Y-beam's a really, really fun weapon. I like it a lot. It's like the, it's kind of like the beam version of the mass shotgun. Kind of. I never, I didn't think about it that way, but yeah, I guess. I, I really like weapons like that, where it's like, it's like, they're pretty good as they are, but if you use them optimally, they're insanely good. I really, I really like those sort of weapons. Yeah, Y-beam is probably a bit too overpowered, but it comes at the cost of you actually having to think. Yeah, I mean, and also the split is quite far away from you. You have to be at, you have to be at the optimal range, and also you have a lot less leeway than you do with mass shotgun. True, true. Because like, look at that. This is like, like there's no way for me to fully take advantage in this room because the room is physically too small. I'm still just proud I managed to get that beam splitting to work. I gotta say, it's, it's very impressive. It, it's a very, very cool weapon. I think just generally, like, when you got on your train of, like, figuring out beam weapons and just making a bunch of beam weapons, you made a lot of really cool ones. Yeah. I I am a genius. I am before my time. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> uh, I love it with the aim assist where it goes really fucking wiggly. <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, it, it's it's really funny with like. Uh, oh, what was it? Uh, it's funny with um. Uh, homing. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, fuck it, it makes me laugh so much. It's, it, it just, I don't know why, but all I picture when I see it is, you know, the wacky waving inflatable arm falling tube man. Wacky waving things. inflatable arm falling <laughs> tube man. Wacky yeah. waving inflatable arm falling tube man. Like, just imagine the, the beam in the middle is just like a face. It's just like, whoa. <laughs> I actually did want to do a gun like that. Oh, I got that'd, bored. that'd be fucking great. I um make it like wooden beam where you, like, you can like sling the arms at enemies to deal damage. Wooden beam is weird because it's the only beam that does damage based on velocity. Exactly. Like if you get slapped by a wacky wave in flat flat the lamp on tube man at high velocity, it's gonna hurt. I need to look into that, like beam velocity at some point. Wait, what? But I uh once one second, one second, one second. What? Explosive birth triggered then. I don't know what triggered it. Oh, was there um, a grenade in the room? No, no, grenades don't spawn in that room. It's just... Did you use your bomb? Oh, it's my bomb. Of course it is. Okay, nice. Wow. You're... You're on fire today. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Squire. Uh... There's actually a lot of things in the game that are technically considered explosions yeah there is there's a lot of things it's, it's why explosive cal birth is, is so good 50 cal is just a stat upgrade it's like a slight damage upgrade and a shot speed upgrade yeah i quite like it uh but yeah katana bullets is one the katana slashes are coded as explosions Ooh, i hope we get those then yeah ex explosive birth i mean anyone that watched the last episode where i got the dyna mallet um, it's just a really, really fun, um, addition. I really like it. Also, I don't, did you watch the last episode that we did? Uh, I don't, I don't remember. I can't believe, Hold on, I, need, I, need to, I, I need can't to believe you betray me. Like, <coughs> <I'm> not, <coughs> I thought you were going to anyway, mute. Okay. <laughs> no, no, I did it just because you're being, uh, meanie. Anyways, in that episode, I think I, I did my best dodging I've ever done. I just got the dynamite, a melee weapon, and stood face to face with Wallmonger and dodged everything. The only time I got hit was when a bullet literally spawned on top of me. I see. Let it me... was, oh, I was, I was impressed with myself. Let me see a Tormon video. Let me, let me take a, let me take a little looky wooky at the <laughs> video. Looky wooky. Turtle wooky. Oh lord. Please stop. <laughs> yeah, it looks like I did accidentally miss that one. I'll, I'll open it up. I've just been all over the place lately. I'll look at that one later. Get themed. I love how much the wide glows I'll, as well. I'll give you your YouTube views, Mr. Toto Watermelon. Fucking better do. I'll sue if not. I have an obligation. That, that squire did some work there. What? <laughs> yeah, I did. Whenever uh, one of my videos pops off, it's just never named in the basement with six computers just refreshing non-stop. No, yeah. So that it counts as of you. That, that's the that's the unreal part about what you said. It is. Come on, though. See, so now the spells seem pretty rare, but on the first floor, you got like four. I'm, I'm going to say maybe I just got exceedingly lucky. Oh, I had. I know this is unrelated, but I've just got to. I've just got to sort of talk about this because it was. I haven't talked about it to anyone yet, and it was just kind of baffling. I had a run on uh, on Binding of Isaac yesterday. I don't know if you've used uh, the Ipecac mod much, but in that mod, there's uh, an item called Devil's Box, which is an active where when you use it, it has a chance, a fifty percent chance to deal um, to deal three hearts of damage, or a fifty percent chance to give you two Devil Deal items. Um, and I got Bad Egg, which corrupts an item like TM Trainer. And I got a corrupted item that on kill activated Devil's Box. Oh my god. I had literally hun I exhausted the Devil Pool like in like two floors. I was just, I got Damocles and Is I was getting like literally hundreds of items. But for some reason, it, it, uh, it wasn't, no. But for some reason, it like, it like wasn't. Um, giving me the, the take three hearts of damage effect, like, at all. It gave me it, like, two or three times, but, oh, God, I got hit again. I really need to get my, uh, 
I really need to get my, what's it called, uh, flawlesses, just in case another bunny uh, room comes up. What are those rooms called, by the way, bunny? Because I just keep calling them bunny rooms, and that's obviously not what they're called. The Welcome to the bunny room. But, uh, yeah, I haven't played... I may not play the Ipecac mod, or know what it's about, or understand it, or code in Lua, or... <laughs> <laughs> but I, I have been doing art for them recently. Yeah, I mean, also as well, like, I was looking through the accepted suggestions list from the last, like, accepted suggestions, and it's just a sea of your name. Yeah, I know, right? Like, basically and everything you suggested got accepted. <laughs> Funny thing is, the last month or so, I haven't even, like, suggested stuff. I know. So, <laughs> so they're just working through the backlog. Pretty crazy. Good bomb use. Good bomb use. I use, I use it mainly for the, um, for the explosive birth thing. Just because it's on such a low recharge, I might as well just throw it out whenever. But, uh... Yeah, I've been helping them fill out their, uh, enemy death sprites. You know, the things that appear on yeah, the... Yeah, I remember. The, uh, yours looks really good for that, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's difficult because there's a lot of them, but, you know, hopefully I can get them up to speed and then they can make someone else do it. I made them a few sprites as well, actually. I'd like a requirement if you if you suggest an enemy, you have to give the sprite. <laughs> no, um, when I was, uh, quite a while ago now, they've been added to the game officially, for, uh, to the mod officially for quite a while now. But I made them a bunch of rooms for the repentance flaws. Uh, the alt path for their custom enemies um, and a few of the enemies didn't have like dross sprites so I made them some dross sprites like just recolored them to, to fit the floor more. Sick. I don't know if they're using them yet to be honest but yeah they look pretty good. Um, I wonder if they added Scoli Olex yet. They haven't no but he's on the list. Oh nice nice. I was going to say, is a really good idea for a boss. I, a I was just name. looking at stuff like, <laughs> and I heard like, hmm, scoliosis, scoliosis, that's a bad thing to do with spines. And it kind of sounds like Skolex. They have the same starting syllable. Yeah. Hmm, <laughs> I can do something with this. It's like, this is Binding of Isaac Gold right here. How has no one done this? <laughs> it's just Skolex with an extra syllable. And yeah, I gotta say, um, like, it seems really good. Also, On April Fools, his name changes to Skolex, but with an extra syllable. Oh, Bono Worm. I'll accept that <laughs> as well. I have to say as well, I, I know that you're not really using mods until you get Dead God, which I don't know how far you are off now, but... Um, I'm like... Uh, okay, I'm one completion mark and some item touches off Dead God, and I'll be honest, I might just cheat the item touches because The item boring. touches are really boring, you're right. Um, yeah, uh, one mod that I highly recommend you get even now before you finish dead god someone made a mod that adds um, champion versions to all the repentance bosses and it is so high quality it's really really good they all feel very vanilla and they're very high quality and like bombina has like a key beggar and a rotten beggar version and they, they just look awesome that's so good why not a demon why, why, why not a demon I, beggar version? i think there's going to be a demon beggar one eventually but not, not so far this is a really cool I'm room just, i like the idea behind this I'm, I'm actually disappointed that there was never a bombo. That'd be pretty cool, yeah. <laughs> bombo, one. Oh, it's candle, baby. Ah, uh, secret room to the left, I think. What's that? Secret room, and yeah, I think this might be a secret room to the left. Yeah, you're right. The wall was just slightly deep. I was like, what the colored. fuck is this room? Then realized I made it. Yeah, you fucking made it. Super hot watch. Fuck your. Go away. Take this and let the agony of solitude fill your veins. Of solitude. Go away, super hot watch. S T M I ass. I mean, it's overpowered, but just because you don't like it, it's not entire overpowered. Game. <laughs> but you, it's so cool. You get to weaver in the bullet. It's like it's the Matrix. It's like when you're like first playing the game and trying to actually like go for wins. It's just it's a really fun item to get. But after that point, it's just like go away. Don't like you. Uh, shouldn't there be a, um, cell creep this wall? Shouldn't there be a what? Cell, cell creep. creep. Oh, yeah, there should be. Yeah, you're right. I'm not entirely sure if he's going to spawn because, uh, he only I've already, I've already dropped it get... on the floor, so. <laughs> oh. I, I dropped it on the floor in the secret room and left. I didn't realize that you did. 
It's so bad, I'm not even willing to send, sell it for money. Wow, you are an idiot. Are we going into the beyond? Yeah. Wait, without without even fighting the boss? Not going to do the boss this floor for some reason, yeah. <laughs> I don't know why. Yeah, I, I should really, I should really get my master rounds in case a new thing appears. Ooh. Oh, it's that sword. Oh, you are fucked. <laughs> I don't care. Did it get a buff though? Is the question? Because last time I used this thing, it was ass. Like damage-wise, at least. Visually, it's very cool. Hey, friend. Hello, Mister Overseer. Excuse me. Ah! The fucking shield fucked me up there! Ah! Was... Stop! <laughs> Dude, just dodge roll. It's like barely more difficult than the beholster. No, no, I know that. It's just the shield, like, sort of, the way that it made the beam disappear confused the fuck out of me. Remember, I am simple. Incredibly simple. So, we've gotten two laser light shows. Get and rest. he's dead. <laughs> Overseer needs a buff. <laughs> well, to be fair, I am using the old Goldie. The old Goldie is incredibly strong. Yeah, but like the attacks themselves just aren't that difficult. Like you got two. To, no, super to be fair, easy. I gotta say some of them most certainly are quite difficult. Those ones in particular could maybe do with some uh, some like bullet rings in the middle just to make them a little more difficult, or maybe bullets coming at from the uh, from, from the walls behind you or something. Um, but. Some of the attacks are genuinely quite hard. I just got two. I got lucky with two really easy ones. Um, it marks at the two inches mark. What the, what the fuck does that oh, mean? Oh, uh, I know what that means. That's not two inches. <laughs> what the fuck is this? I don't know. All I know is it's marked at two inches. <laughs> Somebody admitting to the world his flaws. Yeah, it's it's okay, Bunny. We 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 accept you. <laughs> so what does this actually do? What, <laughs> what the fuck Wait, is, is this? Just, is that an is that an infinite beam? Like it just goes on forever. <laughs> I quite like that. That's pretty cool. It's very ammo efficient too. I don't know how much damage like, it does, but we'll find out. It it looks like it just has infinite range. I think it does. <laughs> ah. Ah. Yeah, measure the hammer. That'll be. That'll show you. <laughs> It'll... The only problem is that uh, stuff like this, it doesn't keep its length when it like. Yeah. Changes it seems, the target, it seems so... genuinely awful, and I'm dead. That was like awful. How? What the fuck is? What the fuck was wrong with you? I didn't, I didn't even get to use the sword. <laughs> Shit. What is wrong with you? I, I I fucking stood on the conveyor belt and it pulled me into the bullet. You can see it like look, there's a little arrow there. Squire fucking didn't do anything. He's a little bitch. Let's let's go do a quick boss rush so this episode isn't ridiculously yeah. short. Um, what b boss rush unlocks do you have left for my mod? Uh, I don't you know. You can check with the unlocks command. I'll if the breach loads, that is. Um, and then unlocks. What is Check it? I... unlocks. Check. God damn it. Bitch. Um. Okay. Where's it at? Uh. Turbo gems. Up. Oh no, you've gotten all my boss rush unlocks. Gotten them all. Uh. You want to, uh. Hmm. You want to try a challenge? God, no. <laughs> you still need to do Invisible O and Toil in Trouble. Bubble, bubble, toilet trouble. Let's try it. Right, pick a character that'll Fucking help Fucking can't play as Paradox, can I, you gim? Yeah, right, you know what, what is me? it? Uh, NN Challenges, I think it's one command. It's not. One command. NN challenges one word. Do, do you know? Try adding some consistency to your commands, you gimp. I'm going to yes, call you a gimp again turtle. to reinforce. It's yes, turtle, but I didn't know how to set it up at the time. Right. Toilet Trouble's activated. Let's go. Also, actually, maybe talk to the quest guys. The quest guys? Yeah, the hunting quest guys. 
Oh. <laughs> 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 they wasn't expecting that, but there you go. Big. Yeah, you haven't got any items from these guys. You've just been playing. It's like, you still uh, get through to them to get to my hunting quest unlocked. Oh shit, yeah. To be fair, the quest, the, the hunting unlocks are just dog shit. <laughs> I really think they need a, like, a major rework because they just take way longer than the normal unlocks for a decent they, player. They're the sort of thing that will just happen as you play, so long as you remember to check them. Oh, I missed this. Why do they have so much health? Because the health has not changed. They still have the health oh. of the normal enemy. Still need to figure out how to fix those fucking outlines. It's unbelievable. Anyone who knows how to fix the outlines, hit me up. Please, I'm desperate. He is. <clears throat> I'm a desperate man. Desperate dreams. So this isn't too bad at all. I did, I did attempt this before, didn't I? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, you, you've tried it a couple times and failed. Oh, fuck you. Why? <laughs> Why? Because it's double. Yeet. I see you there, little lonely fella. Um... Oh god, it's gonna be gonna be one of these situations where one of the fuckers got stuck in a wall. Okay. Oh, there we go. <laughs> I got it, I got it. Well, I definitely think champions make this a lot harder. <laughs> well, the champion didn't get double. Oh. Maybe we found a little way of getting around this challenge. Just make Not everything sure. a champ. Just put, put all champion mode on. <laughs> Easy. Yes, but uh, there's no... You won't fail the challenge, but I will strangle Ah! Him. That scared the shit out of me. I didn't see that guy fight the missile. Well, you know, we did we did expect this to be a quick run, so... Yeah. I'm going to say, I'm, I'm hoping to make it to at least floor three here. It depends on... It basically depends on my chests. If I get decent chests... Fuck you, no, no. Um, <laughs> I didn't make that room. I don't care. Did I did I even remotely indicate that you made the room? I just wanted to say fuck you. Is that so bad? Now this is horrible. <laughs> Blame neighborino. When it, whenever anything goes wrong, blame neighborino. Hey, why the fuck is the raccoon not doubled? What is this? He should be. I think it's just an issue with. Like, when he spawns. Ah, uh, to be fair, that is true. Yeah, he'll spawn after the room. It's, it's just odd. I'm not entirely sure why some enemies don't get doubled. Like, why for some reason an enemy becoming a champion prevents it from doubling. I love the way that when they die, their body grows. Yeah, playing corpse scaling is something that I, I think Apache's done, and I cannot be bothered to learn. <laughs> Fuck is this wave? God damn, a lot of enemies. That's the oh idea. Boy, that's a I'm lot of noise. I'm glad you're noticing the whole premise of the exercise. <laughs> I love the way that because the uh, the enemies are shrunk down, like their facial features kind of like phase in and out of existence as they walk, and they like yeah, all they blend scrunkly. together. <laughs> it looks they great. Look scrunkly, scrunkle, scrunkle, scrunkle. Oh hello. I think, actually, these two would be a very nice combination. Wait, and there's a table tech in Bellows shop too. Yeah. <laughs> you could get four table techs on this floor if you got it, if you got the cash. I don't Tip, remember dude, if I made the grenade. You can't. I went to flip the tables and it was just like no. <laughs> it just <laughs> rolled over and destroyed them. You little dick. Okay, so this was an important exercise. You killed 
both gun nuts and both of them dropped the same amount of currency, so you are getting double money. Nice. I just couldn't remember if I coded it that way. That's good, because that means there's actually like a, a benefit to this challenge in some way. There's like one very good thing about it. Yeah, I just couldn't remember if I coded it that way, so I, I, I went quiet, paying very close attention. <laughs> See, look, Bullock and both yeah. dropped two I did, I did think that, because in the, in the previous room, not, not not the one we just did with the fireplace, the one before that, before the shop, I got ridiculous amounts of money from that room, so I did assume that was the case. I like to get stuck in I'm walls, sure. those fellas. I need to fix that, but oh, I'm not entirely God sure. Oh, damn, how. I didn't see these enemies here. They're so small known for they're marked at the two inch marker <laughs> ow stop blowing up my tables you fucking cunts Taken just started wiggling like aggressively the moment you said that which is weird because she can't hear you <laughs> she's she can just hear the high frequency yeah, it's coming through the headphones and she just hears you fucking cunts please read your turtle bone <laughs> That's it's exactly me, Turtle Schmertle. Turtley Wortley Pudding and Pie. Kiss the girls and make them cry. <laughs> this is what everyone in your country thinks of British people. Oh my god, what's with the fucking brown chests? Go away. Kelly ho, uh, uh, hello, governor. Fine day for a, a jiffy spiffy. A, a rootin' tootin'. A... Uh, 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 curly whirly. Can you offer a curly whirly? Curly whirly. Right, there better be tables in the boss room somehow. I mean, if it's Gatling Gold, they can. You've lied to me. They can, and they absolutely <laughs> did. I'm still very glad that I managed to make both bosses. Yeah, this is, uh something. Hello. I wasn't dealing with you yet. Can you go away, please? I like the fact that they're both on different... Like, obviously, this this is kind of obvious that this is how it would work anyways, but I like the fact that they're both on different timers. Like, they're not doing the same attacks at the same time. Yeah, I definitely coded that, and that isn't just dodge roll. I, I know that that's working. just how it works in general, but I'm glad that that's how it works. It'd be a bit too easy or hard, depending on the boss, if he both did the exact same thing. And I, I kind of wish that I could um, make more bosses duplicate, but that would require some major reworking of stuff like the dragon. Yeah. Like, You'd have dragon to like, completely change this arena. And don't get me wrong, it'd be fun, but... Also, I think a lot of his attack patterns just would not work overlaid on top of each other. Yeah. Like, if you got them both into the heart phase at the same time, you would be actually fucked. Then don't do that. Damn, I wish I had the explosive thing now. The explosive there. I'd be so good with this. Here's hoping for Blomp. A what? Blomk. What the fuck's that? It's an item from my mod, silly. Blomk? What the hell does it do? Uh, whenever a bomb goes off, there's a mini blank. Ooh, that would be good. This is also, like, genuinely one of my favourite things in the entire game, so happy to have it. Yeah, Mahogany's good. I gotta say, ma Mahogany, for me at least, is like, it's a really cool, like, gun design-wise. It's quite fun to use, it's incredibly ammo efficient, it does reasonably good damage for its tier. It's just all around a really, really good weapon. But yeah, like most I'm of just... all, I just think design-wise it's a very cool weapon. I, I, I'm i finding a scab on my elbow and I don't know how it got there because I haven't wounded my elbow at all recently. Well, you must have. Or someone wounded it for me. <laughs> so <Someone's> just like <laughs> coming into your bedroom at night and like cutting your elbows and leaving. Yeah. You, you think that's you say that like it's ridiculous. <laughs> I'll have you know that's a serious problem. 
God damn. <laughs> the amount of table techs. I love the fact that there's a table tech NPC now. Is that from Bunny's mod or yours? I don't think it's from either, actually. I, I just about to say, if you said, I don't know if it's from mine, then I was like, what the fuck? Really? Yeah, I, oh, I'm just so cool. Oh, we got so the P cool. cannon. Shit. I haven't had the P cannon in so long. P cannon. P fucking amazing. The, the P cannon is marked at the two inch. <laughs> <laughs> God, I'm such a child. Ah! Oh, I can't believe I dodged that. That was pretty pretty skillful, considering I did it completely by accident. <laughs> I've set everything on fire. Fuck. Oh my god. Honestly, P Cannon might carry me here. Like, it, it, the, the fact that it does good damage is great, but the biggest thing is the knockback. I'm able to separate all the enemies out from each other by just knocking them back. Good point, good point. And do that. Kill him. And also the P cannon has redonkulous amounts of ammo. <laughs> yeah, I mean that's kind of its thing, it's an upgrade on the worst gun in the game, so it should be fucking amazing. I don't think I've actually had the P cannon synergy in a real run, like ever. I can't remember. Like, I don't think I ever have. <laughs> It's, it's because uh, isn't isn't the pea shooter cla there. classed as like shit tier or crap tier, yes. whatever it's called? So it's one of those guns that you just never see. Yeah. Yeah, the game would rather give you anything else. When are you making weapon class custom chests? Never. I don't want to. I think that's dumb. No, it's not. Cool. Oh shit, there's two of them, I forgot. Get back here. I love the fact that because of the, uh, because he's tiny, the sprites on his eyes are all fucked up. So like, look at him, he's like fucking raving. He looks like he's like on shrooms having the best time of his life. <laughs> you would know. <laughs> I've not had shrooms. Most certainly he's, not. You're a, you're a dirty little mush, mushroom guzzler. I saw how you looked at the fun Ganon last run. <laughs> Looks quite quite a lot of fun. What the hell's this thing? Heart of gold, you get ten uh, money on get taken damage. Oh, bad then. It's fine. Look, you can use it if you have spare hearts to get more money. It's just that's, like... that, that's actually true. Yeah, I suppose for the spare. Oh fuck! I did not think about this. It's oh, like Lord. half of a. It's like half of a vampire. Basically. Yeah. It's, to be fair, that's actually. I didn't really think about it from the perspective of using it on spare hearts. It's actually really good for that. Oh my lord! The fuck's going- Ah! <laughs> what the, the fuck just happened? He's, he's beginning to believe. <laughs> this is r like- Oh my god, I, I think I might die. Why aren't they dying? I think so you're hitting the same one each time. Fuck me, this is so difficult. <laughs> okay, I got oh, one. I got one's one. dead. That there was we really hard. I did actually forget about the fact that the reward here would be incredible. Also, what the hell is going on with... Oh, I see now. The the boss icon for the room was overlaid with the next room's icon, but it's because there's so many things inside the room. I understand now. Yep. Gaming. Hey, hello. Shell of the time. That's one way to put it. Fuck your chicken strips. Right, um... Ooh, hello. Ooh, super room. Now, now you want that, uh... Yeah. That <laughs> of gold? I very, very much wish I'd have bought it now. That is a ridiculous amount I mean, of money it, it's available. It's still in the shop, isn't it? Yeah, but I, I can't afford it yet. But then again, there is quite a lot of the floor left, so I should be able to get it. Why didn't I fucking... ask, him, ask him if you can borrow it and then pay it off. <laughs> That's like, if you if you lend me this money, I will pay this exact money back to you by making more money with your money. Ah, Sounds like a solid investment. So there's people who send their money to, like, uh, Prince Najiv, who needs oh it, uh, because he's My, my, my friend was telling me about uh, about his girlfriend's mum that fell for one of those scams. 
Um, and yeah, I gotta say this, she sent like thousands of pounds to this guy that was gonna invest it all in crypto for her and make her a bunch of money. And it's like, oh my god, you dense motherfucker. <laughs> Like, if you are one of those dumb, like, dumb fucks, I'm just gonna say, if you're one yeah. of those dumb fucks who wants to invest in crypto, at least do it yourself. Like, scam yeah. yourself. You're like, oh yes, I will let someone else uh, make me rich. But like, Because that's the, how the, money the, works. The stupid thing as well is that, like, even after having been scammed and this guy who was like, Apparently her boyfriend, obviously not, but like she thought was her boyfriend, had stopped talking to her after getting all this money. She still believed it wasn't a scam. She was still adamant that like he was a good guy. Oh, that's fucking amazing. You just don't understand him. This is gonna be a lot of longer of a run than I anticipated, but that's that's kind of okay. <laughs> um we might just have a bit less time yeah. for the episode later on. Yeah. Um. Oh, sorry. That that just reminded me of the uh, the Alaskan. I think it was Alaska. It was this awful murder. The what? Uh, there was this awful murder that this woman did because she had been convinced by a random guy on an internet chat room that. A oh, babe, you're totally my girlfriend, and like, if you, I'm a rich, like, millionaire living in like, Texas, and if you kill for me, I'll say I'll make you uh, rich. And she was like, "Sounds legit." The oh, fuck? <laughs> like, you have to be severely mentally unstable if anyone can convince you to kill someone for any reason, and you can do it. You go ahead and do it. If if you can be convinced to kill someone and go through with it, you have to already be severely mentally unstable. Like. I'll be frank here. Yeah, I'm not going to beat around the bush. Money is very nice. I personally wouldn't kill someone for it, but I wouldn't be surprised if someone did. I, it wouldn't make it good. It wouldn't make it right. But it would be something that I wouldn't be surprised by. Yeah, true, true, true. Okay, so like, this item's pretty fucking good. <laughs> Changed my tune quite quickly on this one. I feel like I accidentally endorsed murder and I didn't mean to. I keep forgetting there's going to be two bosses and I'm always surprised, like, fucking surprise Pikachu, like, oh! <laughs> and it's like, wait. Thank God I have the Ring of Imperial form because this is a terrible boss. Um, so, yeah, they, uh, this woman just totally believed that this random guy she met on the internet was actually super rich and would make her super rich. And, uh, yeah, the, they did unfortunately manage to kill someone, but it was so, such a laughably, like, full attempt that they got caught immediately. Yeah. Well, that's the thing as well, like, if you, like, that, that, this is the questionable thing. The person on the internet that asked this person to kill them, like, I, was, I suppose they don't really care if they get caught, but, like, you're never going to get someone that can do it well, because most people don't know how to kill people. Or at least don't know how to not get caught killing people. Yeah, so this the, the, the perpetrator was a teenager in Alaska who's like, mm, yes, I will gather up my, all of my friends and we're going to go murdering. Okay, no. And, uh... It's so stupid. Because they, like... Why'd you pick up the armor? Because the thing Rat steals it, doesn't it? I can't remember. He might not. No, I think he does, actually. But yeah, you get the point. It's it's just how do people how do people think they're going to be like master criminals? Yeah. To be fair, it's it it's genuinely surprising how much confidence the unfathomably stupid have. But I'm unfathomably <laughs> stupid, and I have no confidence. So, and that's that's another thing as well. Like I can't. There's a there's a name for it. I can't remember what it's called now. But like there's, there's a name for a, for a a thing where people that Dunning Kruger. Are, what? The name is Dunning Kruger. I, I don't the know the Dunning Kruger effect. What? Uh, did you even know the effect I was going to talk about? Yes. What was I going to talk about? Exactly. <laughs> 
stupid people overestimate the capabilities. No, it, it was that, but also the fact that, like, intelligent people think that they're dumb and dumb people think that they're smart. That is the Dunning-Kruger yeah, effect. Okay, okay, it's the same thing, okay. But yeah. You are hilariously predictable. <laughs> I've just got all your responses mapped out. I've actually replayed this scenario. I, I gotta say, uh, Nevin actually just wrote the game. this. He actually wrote the script for this episode, but didn't tell me you about just it. He a, just knew. <laughs> you were just a game to me. Oh, fuck. I'm hard to just get hit there. That was dumb. Oh, look at the little Cubulon's little eyes. They're so cute. <laughs> Itty witty squidgy eyes. <laughs> Itty witty squidgies. Stop taking damage, you utter spastic. God damn. <sighs> but yes, that is the Dunning Kruger effect. And it was in full force. <laughs> I had to delete uh, and I, I say I had to. I ended up deleting an Isaac video recently, like that. I, I got halfway through recording, mainly because um, I uh, like. I think one of the mods was broken and it was fucking up the run. Um, but also because I like went on this like massive tangent about I th about how dumb I think people that watch Love Island are. And then like on reflection, I was like, God damn, that was so mean. I can't upload this. Like I can make it known that I think people that watch Love Island are dumb, but God damn, I went off and I was like, I can't upload this. This was like the meanest thing I've ever said. <laughs> no, kill him. Got him. <laughs> I was, like, I was like, I very highly doubt many people that watch my channel watch Love Island 2 because I feel like generally on YouTube you end up garnering an audience that is similar to yourself because obviously they're usually there partially oh, for your personality. God, that's, a, that's a horrifying well, idea. It is true though because like, you're, especially if you're a commentary channel, one of the main reasons people watch you is for your commentary and your personality, meaning they must at least somewhat relate to your personality and somewhat agree and share your values. That's fucking terrifying. I don't want to consider that. <laughs> for you, it, be reality. For, for, for your channel, it's not quite the same because you do more like fact videos and stuff and like law videos. So. Is this on the map? On the map? On the map? Look at the map. Is this the Amogus room? Is it? Dude, that's yes. stretching it a bit thin. Yes, yeah, a thin Sussy Amogus. To see Amogus on a diet. I mean the, oh, mean the, the boys. The are so cute. I always call them charcoals. She got some charcoal from my Discord, but the little colas are so cute. Yeah, didn't Bunny make like baby ones? I should make a yeah, charcoal did. companion at some point. Uh, uh, I, I, I keep telling uh, all these things I want to make when I'm like focused on inscription at the moment, but honestly, I have been doing some stuff with Gungeon recently. I made I'm a new gun. been fixing stuff though. Yeah. Oh! Fuck you, you little shits! Why did you have He's to go doing, different ways? Doing what I can to fix stuff, yeah. really. Like, uh, Bot's been helping me make the shade an inherent character in, t in the mod. Oh, uh, so yeah, yeah, yeah. Rather than, yeah, I'm gonna say, I know, I know not a Bot's been doing a lot of stuff with that. And with that comes a huge amount of uh, shade polish. Everything from, like, mechanical polish to animation polish. Nice. So hopefully the shade will be a lot of a better bouncing baby boy. Like it. I like it. Oh shit, I've got rat boots. Got that. I don't know why some enemies break the outlines and some don't. Yeah, like, I don't, I don't know. Can, it, seems to be, spawn. it seems to be only the duplicate ones that do it. I mean, yeah, it's an issue with the duplication. But, like... Look, those two bulletkins, their outlines, even though one of them's a duplicate, the duplicate's outline is fine. But those two gunjurers, one of the, the duplicate has a fucked outline. Yeah. And I don't know why it, it's like working on bulletkin, but not gunjurers. We live in a society. We really do. Oh, fuck. What? <laughs> Round. After roundabout, the fuck is this? Uh, use the supply drop just so you can keep your ring. I know. Is I the, know. Is this Ski's uh, hit album? <laughs> Several years to write. Okay. 
a lot. It's the first world of it's the first word of the song, the world. Because it has it has a um it has it has a globe on the cover. And if the first word of the song is the world, then I'm going to beat Ski to death. <laughs> Why? Oh fuck this room. Fuck this room. Fuck this room in the ass. Fuck this room in the ass. Oh, if if you know, you know. I do not know. Then you don't know. <laughs> that is incredibly true. Hit the nail on the head with that one. Yeah, you know? I, I find it funny reading, like, older books, because they're, they're like, mm, yes, at the very end, that was just reminded me, because you said nail and hit on the head, and for some reason that reminded me of a riddle from an old book, which made me think about old books. You, you just went on, like, five tangents in your head in, like, a second. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it hurts. Make it stop. <laughs> um, but, yeah, these old books, you'll re be reading them, and it'll be like, yes, and if you want to join the, the, the fan club, you send a shilling to 143 Topper Kenny Lane, London. It's like, <laughs> yes, I'll send, I'll send them a shilling. It's probably, like, a laundromat these days. <laughs> right, let's actually see what this thing does in combat. Oh, it just stops enemies from doing anything. Yeah, it stops time, genius. What did you think it did? I don't know, I just oh. thought it made things old. Like oh, you. Just like sepia turn, mega. Oh, it's the um, B gun, which is this 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 gun confuses the shit out of me because it's like it's just the hive, but like with less ammo, <laughs> and that's it. Like I don't know why I does it, it exist. A, I think it has a higher fire rate, but that's it. It seems just almost completely pointless. It exists to be a Terraria reference. Yeah, because I, I think it actually—I think it has a higher fire rate than the hive, so it's technically doing more DPS, but like. But like, it has so much less, it's less ammo. <laughs> it's less reliable. Jammer mancers, stop being you selves. Ow, I saw some spikes. I, re I really wish you could stop being you. <laughs> I love—I love it when people tell me that. Um. Uh, but, but yes, it's—it's it's just so funny seeing that like. Oh, you you still think shillings have purpose? <laughs> That's so cute. You old bitch. Well, oh, hello. But there was one book that, which is where I learned the age-old riddle, uh, what walks on its head all day. I do not know. The nail in your shoe, which makes no sense in modern context. Oh yeah, no, it doesn't. <laughs> Okay, oh, the time stopping effect isn't very reliable, but there you go. Like, fucking hell. You know, uh. Who puts nails in shoes? Unless they're trying to get tetanus. Ow! Yeah, I don't think that's something anyone does <laughs> anymore. Yeah, it's just funny. It's just funny to me. Same way when uh, a character's like, Hi, you can call me Dick. <laughs> yeah. My name's Dick, and this is my sister Fanny. Yeah, they are names that did not age well. <laughs> that was actually in a book. In, in one of, that's actually in one of the books on my bookshelf. <laughs> He's like, oh, yeah, I'm, I'm your cousin Dick, and this is my sister Fanny. Nice. <laughs> God damn, I'm kind of struggling now. I'm losing a lot of health. But, on the plus side, I have a... Donkulous amount of money. Wait, can I afford um, Lodestone now? Because Lodestone would be a just amazing pickup right now. I can't, but if I hurt myself twice, I can. I hurt myself today. Hurt yourself in the pit. Well, I don't need to hurt myself yet. I can do the boss first to see if I can afford it after the boss. To see if I still need it. 
Focus on oh, really? The altar almanac? No! Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, the swarm! <laughs> to be fair, if I don't destroy the bells, ow, 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 I can passively keep. Oh, there's so many glamours! Passively keep one yeah. of the bosses from appearing. Oh, wait, no, why is there still bells about? What the hell's going on right now? I think it might be just be a glitch. Just this is kill one very of those confusing. Possible. You, sh you should use your invincibility to run in front of the claymores to get rid of them. Yeah, that's what I just did a minute, a minute ago, yeah. Look at this claymore. <laughs> He's just spinning forever. Oh my lord! The fuck was that? I'm about to die. You still have a blank. That I do. Maybe use a blank. Is your thing recharged? No, well, uh, it was nice knowing you. You said you wanted to get to the mines. Shit! Shit! No! That is a ridiculously hard boss on this challenge. Oh my god. <laughs> I really should have got reload stone before doing the boss. You are correct. The dubious little creature was, getting up fun, to though. mischief. That was fun though. And actually, we've, uh, it's probably a good, good thing that I died because we're an hour and five minutes. I probably wouldn't want to go for too much longer. Anyhow, I hope you guys enjoyed. This has been a lot of fun. I, I, I honestly had forgotten how fun it is to record Gungeon with someone. It's it's, it's, a, it's a lot of fun. Anyways, oh, we're, yeah, gonna yeah. Go, we're gonna go and play some Portal uh, for probably like two hours. Um, he's gonna play Portal and I'm gonna yell at him. Well, yeah. He never named Nose Portal like the back of his penis. Um, and I don't who, remember any of it. <laughs> is, that is a question. Who looks at the back of their own penis? Where, which, which part is the back? Oh god, it's the inside, <laughs> isn't it? <laughs> Like, is the back the bit that faces you, or is the back the bit that faces others? I won't even say faces others. The back of the back of your penis is your <laughs> asshole. <laughs> this is this is a question that we need to um we need That's to, like, Turtle Man's to question of the day. <laughs> this is the question of the day for this video. What do you think is the back of the penis? <laughs> we need to like publish this to leave some it scholars. A, leave it a, leave it in the comments down below. Is there any leading experts that we can contact? Yeah, are there get, any can, penisologists? Can, get, can I get someone on the podcast? Yeah, like, uh... <laughs> Jim's cock and stiff. Uh, oh, leading God. penisologist. You'd, you could just imagine you'd bring them on to ask them genuine questions, and it'd just be like uh, one of those people that sells, like, enlargement pills. <laughs> well, I don't... I know the back of the penis is easily reached through our <laughs> leading secret formula. Oh. It, for some reason, it just makes me think. Have you ever seen the film Super Bad? Nope. This is a really good film. There's a, there's a line in that where, um, like, he's buying a girl booze and she's like, "Oh, well, you scratch my back, I'll scratch yours." And he says, "The funny thing about my back is it's located on my penis." <laughs> it just, oh, it just reminds me of that. Oh my god, why have we come onto this tangent? God, Portal's gonna be a fucking sorry affair. Holy shit. My. Anyway. Goodness. Leave, Anyways, leave, yeah, let's, leave. <laughs> let's fuck stop, off. Let, let's stop this. Fuck off. Again. You're not welcome here anymore. Click off the video. Go away.